Hi, I'm Bill Myers, and this is another one of my video tips of the week. In this week's video tip, I'm going to show you how to use a free noise gate plugin to remove or reduce noise in your video tracks. Let me show you what I mean. Here on the timeline, I've got a video track that was shot with a GoPro camera mounted to a bicycle that was going down the sidewalk beside the intercoastal waterway. And it's a really nice production, except for it picked up a lot of tire noise from the bike. When I play it, you'll be able to hear that. <laughs> I wanted to get rid of the tire noise without getting rid of the other noises in the background like the birds and the boats and the other things that were going on. And I'm able to do that by using a noise gate. Let me show you what I mean. On the audio track, I click the track effects button and it brings up the audio plugins. The three plugins you see here are standard for all your audio tracks. And there is a noise gate plugin, but I don't find it to be too effective. There's an equalizer, which is pretty useful, and then a track compressor. But I wanted something a little bit more powerful. So I added a free noise gate plugin and it's called Floorfish. And I click that and then click OK. And it brings up a noise gate that looks like this. And the way it works is that you start your production and then you click Listen and then you adjust it until the noise is gone. And you see you can still hear the background noise but the tire noise is gone. Now that's the way it sounds with the noise gate on. And I'm going to turn it off. I'll turn it back on. You can see it makes a huge difference. Now I'm going to show you how to get that noise gate plug in and how to install it. The first thing you want to do is go to the digitalfishphones.com website. You can see the link on the screen. Once you get to the front page, click the Enter Site button. Once the first page loads up, in the left hand column you'll see the Audio Plugins button. You want to click that. Once the Audio Plugins page has loaded, you want to click on the fish fillet link right there. And on the fish fillets page, you'll see that the different VST plugins that they have. Now, all of these will work in Sony Vegas Sony Movie Studio. So, what you want to do is you want to scroll down to the bottom of the page and click the download button for Windows. You want to download this on your computer and it's going to be a zip file. So, you want to save it someplace on your computer that you can find it and then click save. After you've saved it, you want to open the folder and you want to unzip it. So right click, select Extract All, and put it in a folder in your computer where you can find it. And then click Extract, and you'll see the files that are downloaded. So you'll want to copy each of these files and move those into the VST Downloads folder on your computer. And typically that's going to be in Program Files, VST Plugins. And if you don't have a VST Plugins folder, create one and put it in Program Files. Then paste in the files that you've just copied. Now, you'll want a VST plugins folder because once you discover how easy it is to use VST plugins, it's probably going to download a lot of them. So now that that's done, you want to go back to Sony Movie Studio where we're going to install these. Once you get back into Sony Movie Studio, click Options, come down to Preferences, click VST Effects. Under VST Effects, choose the default VST search folder. And that's going to be the folder that you just unzip those things into. And when you choose that folder, you'll see these items show up. And then you want to select each one of those just by putting check marks in front of those and then clicking OK. Once you've done that, the next time you click Track Effects and you click the Effects icon, you'll see a VST folder that you can click on. And when you click on that, you'll see the VST effects that you have available in that folder. It's really a cool way to add audio effects to Sony Vegas Movie Studio and allows you to do things like we've just done now. And that's by using a noise gate. I'm Bill Myers. This has been another one of my video tips of the week. Find more like this at www.vmyers.com and find a whole lot more in my DVD, 101 Tips and Tricks for Sony Movie Studio, which is available at my website as well as at Amazon.com.